Duffy Bookman was an African-born Jamaican man that played a major part in inspiring the Haitian Revolution. He was born in Senegambia, Africa, but was later shipped to Jamaica. While in Jamaica, he was caught teaching other slaves how to read, so he was shipped to St. Domingue, which is modern-day Haiti. He got the name Bookman because he taught himself how to read. He was a spiritual leader whose prayers and rituals inspired many slaves. Scholars aren't sure exactly which form of African spirituality he practiced, but they know for sure that he definitely was not Christian. He once said, if you want to win, cast aside your white God, embrace your African spirituality, you are free. He held multiple prominent positions. He used this opportunity to plan secret meetings with the slaves to teach them the importance of being free. One week after a pivotal meeting and a spiritual ceremony, the Haitian Revolution began. Shortly after, Bookman was captured and beheaded. His head was put on display to instill fear into the other slaves. All this did was piss them off even more. The revolution raged on, eventually leading to the independence of Haiti. Bookman is remembered for his leadership skills, courage, and his fearlessness. One of his ideologies was only a false god would convince a man that he has dominion over earth. He believed that man should live harmoniously with the earth because everything on earth is precious and important.